inspection day. I'm going over to meet the inspector. Time to inspect houses. They check for smoke detectors. You know, these smoke detectors are designed to last for two years. So, excuse me, ten years. I said two years because they seem to vanish after two years. Ten year worry free, blah blah blah. Ten year worry fee, blah blah blah. 44. 29.88, two pack. You got some splaining to do, Lucy. So, uh, I'm not big on the stock market, but there was a time when Home Depot stock was selling for 20 bucks a share. And I am the happy owner of this store. That's right, I own about eight shares. <laughs> but still, as a share, as a as a stockholder, a shareholder, I hate it when the prices aren't, they don't jive. I better start climbing. So I've got this color paint. And I've got this color paint. This is like an off-white. And I need this color. So, seems to me that it could be done, right? So I took a quarter cup of this and added half teaspoon of this color once, stirred it, and then added it again. I'm going to call that good enough. It's a little, uh, little hallway area. Whoops. Whoa! I think I put too much in. We want just one cup. Okay, looks like we're at one cup. Found it. I had to look through all of them. Come, follow me. We are going to dip once. Dip twice. So that should be six halves. That doesn't sound right, does it? That was a quarter. Let's go back to. Let's reverse. This was a quarter cup. We have a cup, so we need one more of those. One more of these. All right. We take the yard sale, estate sale spoon. We spin this around. I think it's uh, it's getting lighter but it's losing a little bit of the brown that it needs. So I say we call it quits. Here's the color we're after. Here's the color we have. So I'm thinking, I think we got it. I think it'll be good enough. Oh, wait, there's one more thing. 
a little sesame oil. Just, just a dab. How does this come out? Just a dab. That should do it. Just in case, you know, get hungry. I'm just kidding. I put it off to the side. It's an illusion. Okay. So this is why you do it in the kitchen. <laughs> All right, let's go take a look at this color. On location. What do you think? The color match was close enough where cut-in was pretty easy. I did this all in about one hour. So if you take my salary, which is $10 an hour, and you take some old paint and mix it just right, this costs about 10 bucks an hour. What do you think?